There is a brand new series on Disney Plus called Welcome to Earth, where we are seeing never before seen parts of the world. We have Dr. Diva Aman and Dr. Albert Lin, both experts in their field, both with National Geographic and are taking Will Smith on this incredible journey. Uh, tell us a little bit about what we're going to see in the series. Yeah, this series is just, you know, a smorgasbord for the senses. It's about seeing the planet in ways we have never seen it before, seeing the planet in one of the most beautiful ways we've ever seen it before. And of course, we we have Will Smith along for the ride, right, Albert? Oh my gosh, yeah, you know, it's, it's like you've got this alien fighting, world saving, fresh prince superhero with you, but the actual main character <laughs> is, you know, maybe it's planet Earth. It's It's one of those, it's one of those things where you see it and you're like, I've never seen anything like this before. Yeah. And yet this is the planet that we've all lived on together our entire lives. It's a love story for the senses and for nature itself. I mean, and also I think for the, like the sense that we actually live in a totally brand new age of exploration. Diva, you took, you took Will to a place that nobody's ever been before, right? Absolutely. You know, we went to 3000 feet deep off the Bahamas, down into the dark, dark, cold depths. And, you know, we had never been there before. And certainly Will was, uh, you know, more than a little fearful during the whole experience. But once we got down there, some of the things that we experienced together, just absolutely mind blowing. I don't want to ruin the episode, but I mean, hey, you guys were in Namibia, right? Deserts. Oh yeah, the deserts of Namibia. I mean, that was that was another adventure altogether. It, 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 honestly, it started to feel like we were like just two friends on a camp out there. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we were, by the end of it, we we're sharing razors and picking the fuzz out of each other's hair and, you know, having a great time. But we were going through maybe some of the harshest coastline in the world, the skeleton coast in Namibia, where every single day you'd come across these, you know, skeletons of seals that have been a maybe washed up onto the shore or these dilapidated boats that have rusted away on the coastline after a big shipwreck. And we're driving through these dunes. And of course, Will crashes his car to the dune. We crash this truck into the dune. Nobody sees this part, but we totally crash. And we get out of the vehicle uh, to try to push you know, ourselves out of the sand. And we're caught in one of the most visceral sandstorms I've ever been in. And all of the superhero-ness of Will Smith just melts away and we just become two human beings on an adventure together. It's super visceral. It's really fun. And I hope, you know, I hope the viewers get that same experience too. I mean, especially too, you know, when you're on a movie set, you can yell cut if, you know, if one of the cars goes, you know, off the rails or, or something happens. You can't cut, call cut when you're in nature and these things are happening. Was there ever a point where he was scared or holding on to you guys or like, what is happening? And I, I see Diva, go ahead. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, in, in, in Descent into Darkness, which is the episode that um, I lead on, it just, it is very clear that Will is not happy with what is happening. You know, he says at the beginning, he has a fear of the ocean. And here we are going down into the deep sea. And yeah, it was, I think it was, he was, he was just silent for a lot of it. You know, he was just so fearful. But what I found so inspiring is that he was able to push through that. And you'll see that this, these, that fear really gives way to just awe and amazement for this incredible planet that we live on. And for which, you know, we still know so little about. I think it's wild because they were in a little bubble of plastic for set at how many hours? Like nine hours together. Nine hours yeah. descending to the bottom of the ocean. My fear would be, where do you go to pee? Where do you go <laughs> pee next to a superhero like Will Smith? What do you, like, what do you do? How do you, <laughs> how do you do it in a bubble? You got to hold it. You got to hold it. You got to hold it, you know, for nine and a half hours. Exactly. Don't drink any water beforehand. Uh -huh. we we did see in the trailer that he is, you know, during one of the scenes, he's like, I have to put this in a movie. How many times when he was filming with, with both of you, was he like, this is going to make a, a, a great scene in the movie, or we got to add this, or this is so great, or ask things as far as what we might see in his career next. Wow, that's so insightful, because I, I was, yeah, I was totally blown away by that, too. He's always thinking mm -hmm. creatively. His whole presence was about storytelling. You know, I mean, he's always thinking about the next film, the next story, the concepts around us. I remember, you know, I remember having a lot of those moments where uh, I think, I think the journey was pulling out emotions in him that he, that maybe none of us really ever see, even in ourselves, 
because we were experiencing the most beautiful, the most magical, the most terrifying moments of, you know, of our lives. And I think a lot of that brought out the creative juices maybe in the storyteller in him, because I think on set, he came up with like five more film ideas. <laughs> <laughs> I, and I hope you both get cameos in, in those movies. I, that's what I got to say is that I hope you both get, get cameos in those. And I hope, you know, that, you know, especially with this being on, on Disney plus that it's inspires a lot of young um young people and our youth to go ahead and check out some of your other work on National Geographic and you both are experts in your your own respective fields and that gets you know our young minds moving and, and wanting to take care of our planet and uh thank you so much for your time today welcome to earth now streaming on on Disney plus thank Thanks you for having us